Hello everybody, JB Smith Gold Hunter here, and we're just about to start the hunt. If you look in this ditch here, how it kind of snakes down into this low area where it was all dug out, they heaped up all the tailings or the overburden when they were digging down to the bedrock up on these mounds that you can see. See this mound here? And there's a few. Then you can see some of the mullock, some of the uh, rock piles on top of the bedrock. They tore that bedrock up. So if you go in there with a detector, there is none. No gold. I've looked at them all. I mean, there could be a small piece hidden in a crack here or there. But for the most part, that's where they did the most of their work. So then you see some more piles over here. You kind of see like a little pool here like a little settling pond and all these uh, runoffs that go down in here they had sluices in in a lot of those runoffs and they were filling this up with water and feeding the sluices right so they were uh some of this over here where the contour of the land doesn't look disturb too bad except for a couple ditches you may not be able to see from the photos but it's a couple ditches that they ran for for water to keep water flowing and to fill up their little ponds for their sluicing operations now if you look over here by the dogs there's some water right there that runs down through here it just kind of settles in that low spot now above that there's a ridge of hard pack that comes all the way around like this all the way up to this pond that's going to be our main focus to begin with we're going to start over there and we're slowly probably take us an hour to get from over there to over here probably could even take longer and then turn around take a couple steps sideways and then work all the way back on this ridge here and then kind of do circles and whatever. Maybe go up or try to stay away from the uh, the low spot where the water is settling. Too mucky and uh, more difficult. It's easier to get to where, you know, it's not necessarily dry. But, you know, it's uh, a little bit higher ground. Okay, we're looking for specimen quartz. Golden quartz specimens. And we're also looking for native nuggets. So everybody, hope you enjoy the hunt. Here we go.